In this new series I'll be showing you what I believe are the best factions and regiments on the dog. So at number 5 is the Tommies. Tommies consist of a corporal, rifleman, gunner and bomber and within these ranks are subclasses. The corporal is a section leader, scout leader and section corporal. The rifleman has a regular, no man's land sniper and marksman. The gunner has a carrier, Lewis gunner and veteran gunner. And the bomber has a rifle bomber, veteran bomber and thrower. So my reason for picking the Tommies at number 5 is they're all well rounded capabilities that they have. This can be seen from the variation of weaponry and the accuracy of rifles and pistols in the game. Most notably is this, uh, you can see the Webley self-loading pistol and then also the Lee Enfield Mark III rifle. Uh, the Lee Enfield, brilliant weapon on the game, it's good for both attack and defence, especially when it's equipped with a bayonet because you can use, use it for, uh, for close quarter combat as well as long range combat, so brilliant all-rounded all um, weapon. The Tummies also have a marksman who uses the Lee Enfield Mark III with an accurate scope which is probably my personal favourite in the game. It's quite small, it's quite, it feels quite agile so you can look around without fully scoping down and it makes it easier to move and stuff. And uh, using the scope and the pinpoint accurate weapon always makes it dangerous in the battlefield. Great gun. The Tummies also have a Lewis gun which is an accurate light machine gun which can be used effectively both at range and up close. The Lewis gun does not have to be placed and static to fire which is quite a good thing so you can pick it up, you can run around and shoot and uh, the Lewis gun also carries uh, a Webley revolver so you know you can be moved quick, as seen in this clip here you can actually move quite quickly and go to different firing positions and when you're getting pinpointed by a sniper it's good to move when you're an LMG gunner because your flash gives away a lot. And then probably the main reason why the Tommies are in my top five is because of this subclass, the grenade, uh, or the bomber subclass. Now the bomber subclass gets one grenade, or the best one, gets one grenade uh, with a Lee Enfield rifle with a bayonet on and a trench club. Now the trench club works much better than any bayonet on the game. It's accurate, the game seems to program it better, but having the grenade and then your accurate rifle as a backup is, is fantastic as well. And it makes this sort of subclass perfect for both defence and attack and gameplay. If you haven't played as the bomber, you know, I couldn't recommend it enough. So that's the Tommy's taking fifth place in my top five Verdun faction slash regiments. If you enjoyed the video, subscribe because there'll be another one next week and I'll put it all into a playlist. If you're interested in playing Verdun, check out this community. Thanks for watching.